News 8 reported last night convicted cop killer Anthony Bottom, also known as Jaleel Muntakim, is due to speak at SUNY Brockport next month. The engagement is being met with outrage from the community, and Brockport is saying they understand that frustration but are calling this free speech. Today, that outrage, uh, outrage has continued to grow. Christian Garzon joins us live in the newsroom with more. Christian. Well, Bottom was convicted in 1971 of killing two New York City police officers. SUNY Brockport has him scheduled to speak on campus April 6th in a talk called History of Black Resistance, U.S. Political Prisoners and Genocide, a conversation with Jaleel Muntakim. Today, Sheriff Todd Baxter and GOP leaders are asking Brockport to call this off. Sheriff Baxter said today Bottom has every right to freedom of speech, no matter how distasteful. However, for a government agency like SUNY Brockport to seek him out, advertise, and then compensate him defies credulity. Baxter went on to say there can be no earthly redemption for what Bottom did, calling his release from jail an abomination, and for Brockport to promote Bottom's claim he is a victim is offensive. State GOP Chairman Nick Langworthy said Bottom is a cold-blooded domestic terrorist, reminding the public in a statement that Bottom shot one of the officers 22 times while he was pleading to be spared for the sake of his family. Langworthy added Bottom is not reformed and is billing himself as a political prisoner to turn himself into a martyr. He also called for taxpayer dollars to be stopped from funding this event. Port did say while they do not support the violence Bottom exhibited, they do believe in freedom of speech. In the newsroom, Christian Garzon, News 8. John Katrina, right back to you. All right, Christian, thank you again. That talk with Muntakim is scheduled for April 6th.